How are the chickens doing? They're half ducks now. No, this is crazy. You guys, <laughs> look at this. Look at the water we've gotten today. It, it is absolutely crazy. I think I'm going to move to Oregon where it's a little less rainy. Good idea. <laughs> you know what? You guys, we have a major problem. We really do. likes the rain. The problem is that I've got to get to my horse trailer, but there is so much mud here that my any of our vehicles will just slip and slide and create ruts and get stuck so I'm hoping to get my tractor but it won't start <laughs> look at this mud you guys it is crazy the amount of rain we've gotten on the farm today <laughs> still may need to call him that might have been our inspiration from prayers is to call daniel i was going to call matt's off-road recovery to get our horse trailer out start the to start the tractor i think they they'd pull our trailer out for us well guys i've been out cleaning up the yard and trying to spruce it up because i have a sister-in-law coming into town and my rider mower that Vicky got me for my birthday, the belt that engages the, what do you call it, the blades, came off. But I called one of my friends that's actually one of my old students, and he's so kind to come help me out, and come to find out he has actually started a channel of his own. So I've told him thank you, but if you wanna thank him, why don't you go over to Route 66 Classic Builds we live on Route 66 in Arizona, and he loves to rebuild old vehicles. And so, let me introduce you to Daniel. I think it just came off his tools. 
Awesome. So this is Daniel Hutchins. What's up? So tell them what you do on your channel. Uh, so right now we've got two cars I've been working on. Uh, I've got a 66 uh, Cadillac DeVille that we bought. My wife, she does photography. She does like wedding photography and all that stuff. So she wants to get that for couples pictures and engagement photos and stuff. So that it's pretty much, I got it from a guy here in town and all I need to do is just get it running and then paint it. And then I've also picked up a 67 El Camino and I'm doing an engine swap in that. It did, well, it didn't have an engine or a transmission. So I've got a 454 and then a turbo hydromatic 400 that I'm putting in it. So it should be at least good enough to burn the tires. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> so anyway why don't you go subscribe to that channel we'll put a link in the description of our videos are right here below and uh daniel i appreciate you coming and helping me get yeah, this no belt on you're awesome well daniel got it going and vicky's having fun driving it well we kind of got it started for a minute but something's up and now the battery's wearing out. So either I have to jump it, which getting a vehicle down here to jump it won't be easy, or we just wait for things to dry out, I guess. So, not sure. I'm supposed to take a horse to the vet tomorrow to get a Coggins test. So I've got to figure out how I'm going to do that. Maybe I borrow a friend's trailer or something. So, anyway. I thought we were going to get it. Flake was using it just yesterday. Or no, a couple days ago, Saturday. Saturday. Darn it. Hey guys, if you want to know what I'm making to, on the farm today, go check out my channel, Quick and Tasty on the Farm. These things are so delicious. And Alan got a package in the mail. He's gonna open it right now. Curious what's inside. Oh, here, can you hold the box? Yeah, with my sticky hands. With your sticky hands. There you go. I'll try not to cut you. Sharon, thank you so much. I don't know what it is, but I'm excited. Hey, look at me real quick. Guess what, you guys? Quick and tasty on the farm, Blake, when I went out on the farm today, he actually announced what other practice he was going to. Remember on the channel a while ago, we actually said he was not going to sports practice or he wasn't going to do anything with the animals. He was doing some other kind of practice and they were guessing cheerleading and they were guessing dancing, ballet. Yeah. ballet. He announces today on Quick and Tasty on the farm. So go check out my Power Energy Ball video and you'll find out. I'm a mess. Yeah, but they taste good and you look good. Let me wash up and I'll switch the camera so people can see you, you didn't open even this package. Smile when I said you look good. Sorry, thank you. You're <laughs> kind. I was concentrating on being a mess. <laughs> what do you guys think's in the box? It was addressed just to Alan. Peekaboo. I'm sad. Isn't he handsome? Oh. Should I pick <laughs> You guys, he has made me laugh from the get-go, from the very beginning of our marriage. This, so Sharon is 73 years old. She had horses since she was 13. These bands you put on, I sprayed with mist of Avon Skin So Soft. That's funny, your dad oh, cool. used to use that to keep the horses. Uh, so she, I think she commented the other day about that. There's go. Maybe I should have read the whole thing to you, but I'm excited. You put these on their halters or whatever, and they keep the flies off. Oh, that's really so cool. Fly band. And you spray them with skin skin. <laughs> can't talk. Hey, put it on. Let's see how it looks. You could start wearing it outside. There you go. Start a video like that. <laughs> Is this the thumbnail? <laughs> yeah. Hey, it works. No flies have got on me yet. So. That's pretty good because lately we've had flies in the house. That's really cool. 
Sharon, thank you. That's so sweet. You're awesome. The horses are gonna thank you. So I've gotta see how to attach it. Looks like it's just a, a bridal piece. Anyway, this is awesome. Thank you so much, Sharon. Let's go get busy on the farm. really no high spots but there's a high spot in this corral over here so hopefully we can get to the trailer or I'll buy a or borrow a friend's trailer tomorrow but we're gonna go put peaches where there's some higher ground we're gonna miss this girl as she's going to Florida but I'll take you along tomorrow as we get her a Coggins test maybe this was just getting her used to being in Florida where it rains a lot good point she's ready for a hurricane now no, 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 no. Prayers for Florida right now. Look at that. Oops, sorry guys. I got it all over you. So what's this weather supposed to keep doing? Cause this rain's crazy. I think it's supposed to be done today, but I didn't even realize this storm was coming through and I bet we've got two inches. It's been crazy. So anyway, tomorrow the challenge will be how I get my trailer up. Now you may think this doesn't look bad, but our soil around here is clay. And if I try to drive on it right now with a truck, it'll just slip and slide and no traction. And trying to back up to a trailer with no traction is doesn't work. So anyway, I'm standing on a dry spot, but it's muddy and wet everywhere. So I may borrow a trailer tomorrow so I can take peaches to the vet. But now I gotta figure out what's wrong with the tractor. But hey, life could be worse. I have to figure out what's for dinner. <laughs> that, oh, that's horrible. Actually, <laughs> Maybe I better go look at Quick and Tasty on the farm. Give me some ideas. <laughs> as we have, we're getting more water than we've had in years, and it's a blessing, but it's a challenge. I think about Florida and prayers for Florida and for all of you that are suffering. I mean, this is nothing compared to what you're dealing with. Yeah, so that's for sure. We can deal with some wet corrals and not being able to back up to our trailer. So, anyway, God bless and thanks for coming along.